In the recent state election in Thuringia, the far-right alternative for Germany, AFD, party emerged as the largest vote-getter, securing 32.8% of the vote. The centre-right Christian Democrats, CDU, followed with 23.6%, while the new left-wing populist party, Bundnis Sara Wagenknecht, BSW, garnered 15.8%. Chancellor Olaf Scholz's Social Democrats, SPD, faced a setback, achieving just 6.1%, and their coalition partners, the Greens and Free Democrats, did not reach the 5% threshold required for parliamentary entry. Despite its leading position, the AFD is unlikely to form a government, as other parties have ruled out coalition talks with them. AFD co-chairwoman Alice Weidel praised the result as a historical success and urged the CDU and other parties to reconsider their stance and engage in coalition discussions. The left party, once a significant force in the region, saw its support dramatically decline to below 13% from 31% in 2019. Co-chairwoman Janine Whistler described the election results as bitter and expressed concern over the rise of the far right as the dominant force in Thuringia state parliament.